That's not a chopper, baby, it's a hover bike. Are you ready to rock today? <laughs> I don't know about you, but I certainly am. Welcome back to Unlucky Level 7 of Let's Play Apocalypse, where we are taking on second horseman of the apocalypse, our girlfriend. This is Plague, and we are battling her in the club. Uh, overall, this boss battle is pretty awkward, because as you can see, uh, Plague is constantly jumping on the speakers, so it's really hard to catch her. So what you have to do here is uh, jump constantly and try to catch her with your bullets basically. Sometimes she shoots these uh, green stars, uh, which you can easily dodge by rolling or jumping. Green shockwaves will appear. Basically, you have to jump constantly to dodge these green shockwaves. It was really hard to keep your attention on the shockwaves and uh, on the plague herself. When you deal even more damage to the plague, a giant disco ball will appear. <laughs> this disco ball will just stand here in the middle of the center platform and will shoot laser beam at you. Uh, eventually, the disco ball will shoot two more lasers, so in total there will be three lasers and they will speed up as well. By the way, speaking about these shockwaves and these lasers, you can't dodge them while you are rolling around. It won't work, you only can dodge them while you're jumping. So once again, jumping is your best friend here. By the way, there's a really easy way to cheese this boss battle if you're standing on one of the two platforms which are on the sides here. Right next to the sledge here, as you can see. Yeah. What happens? You are not being damaged by the lasers. So basically you can just take your time here and just shoot the boss while standing here. So yeah, as you can see, catching plague is a pretty annoying task. So And yeah, while jumping, also be careful of the bottomless pit, which is down below, because uh, if you jump too much, well, you can fall to your death really, really easily here platforms will eventually start to disappear, so you have to be really quick and jump on the stage itself. So now it's kind of like a second phase. Plague will be constantly chasing you with her knife, which hurts like hell, and will leave this green acid on the floor, which hurts like hell as well. So the trick here is to move kind of like in a circular motion around this menacing looking skull stage. Also jump over these acid pits and shoot the boss that way. Yeah, overall, the second part is not so challenging. I think the first part with all these platforms and the disco ball, lasers, was more uh, tedious. But this one, eh, yeah. Few less shots and... This is it. This is it for Plague. I killed her in pretty cool fashion here, just by standing next to her and going all out that way. So yeah, at the end, Plague received a kiss of death from Bruce Willis, because, well, she is his girlfriend. Well, okay. Was. But yeah, guys, this is it for this boss battle. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode and I'll meet you in the next level. So if you thought that the door boss from the graveyard level was hard, then just you wait for the next level. Next level is a real mother... Whoa! Never seen this trick before. These freaks are grafted to the latest generation of bang stick. What's going on out there? Uh, candy cream. <laughs> well, praise the Lord and pass the ammunition. Freeze, Raper! War sells, baby. And I'm selling to the president of the U.S. of A. Damn! He's heading for the factory floor. Now, before I end, uh, remember I told you to remember one particular song in City Level? This song was actually playing throughout this whole level. But yes, this is uh, Control by Poe, Apocalypse Mix. So enjoy this awesome song in its full glory. Yeah, considering the level was not so long, I just decided to throw something special at the end of it. So hopefully you will enjoy it, guys. So we had our friend Larry, who is Horseman of the Apocalypse. Our girlfriend was Horseman of the Apocalypse. What's next? Our cat? Oh boy. I guess it's time to do a twist. Cause she's
watching you squirm in your shoes A small bit of sweat on your brow and a growl in your belly You're scared to let go You thought you could keep me from loving You thought you could feed on my soul But while you were busy destroying my life What was half of me has become whole Why you were looking the other way Why you had your eyes closed Why you were looking in the hills Cause I was miserable Why you were selling your soul Why you were tearing a hole in me She's still pissed. 